Yeah, that was me pretending to read. Today's the big day. The reason why I'm actually here in London today is the Adidas event. Thank you, Adidas, for having me out here. I really appreciate you bringing me all the way across the world to attend this event. And I'm excited to bring you guys with me. Since this is an Adidas event, you're probably wondering, Kais, what's on your feet? Yo, Kais, anybody down here? We're already down here right now. All right, I'm coming down. I'm at the elevator. Do a quick review of what's on my feet because I haven't told him yet. So, ready, set, go. Uh, hey, he has really expensive shoes on. I was expecting something better. He has really expensive Adidas shoes on. Oh, that, that was better. Good that was job. better. Good. I get four star. Oh, thumbs up the video. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> uh, guys, make sure you subscribe. He's trying to get to a million. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Oh, sorry. A, mi we're gonna, we're a million, and a million and one. A million and one. Excuse me, sir. Can you um, review my sneakers for me? Since I'm about to get hit. Oh, boy. I'm. That mirror hit my back, bro. Just step onto the pavement for me, please. There we go. Are we gonna kick that? I almost got killed. Kick that of Adidas event. So we're inside right now, and obviously you can see that the shelves are empty. So let's finally see what these shoes look like. Bam! The Adidas POD system. So here's a little slight breakdown of the product here. Hold on, man. Hold on, bro. See what I'm saying? Like, I don't know why they bring all you sneaky YouTubers out here. This is the reason why we are out here in London right now. Let's just talk about this shoe right here. This is the Adidas POD system. This is their new sneaker designed, obviously, in Germany. And we kind of got a rundown of the technology in this shoe. Basically, they took old models to create the outsole of the shoe, as you can see. And then you've got, obviously, a little bit of new technology. Well, not new technology, but the newer technology with the boost back of the shoe. Me, personally, I would prefer a full boost bottom, but you know what I'm saying? This is kind of like different, obviously, and you've got that little plate right there. I have not put them on feet, so I do not know how they feel, so I'm interested to see how they feel, but first look, first take on this shoe, it is dope. I feel like Adidas, you know, the, a lot of people claim that the hype is dead, but I honestly like when they try different things because it gives new things for me to try out and experiment with. So I actually do like these. I think they look really, really better on feet. Like Seth Fowler is rocking them somewhere over here. I'll show it to you. I wish the upper was a different material, more of like a knitted material, but this shoe, the good thing about it is like literally they can release different versions of it and we don't know what's to come. So yeah, man, overall the shoe is pretty dope. I'm excited to try them out on feet. The cool thing though is after this section right here that we're in we get to go into another studio and we get to basically create our own shoe now I don't exactly know what we're gonna be doing we're not gonna be creating something that's gonna release or anything like that we're just gonna be having some fun with some of the outsoles and whatnot so it should be a dope experience after this okay so now we are headed to the makers studio is that what they're calling it is it okay so maybe I'm, maybe I'm a little bit off but I think it's around makers yeah all right so this is gonna be interesting because we're gonna be able to create our own shoe Wait for it. <laughs> Not done yet. Thank you. So that's what this technology that makes. I want to kind of make it look like a like a the chunky dad shoe. Guy. Okay, yeah, yeah. Pretty much what I was going for, simple, that shoe, bulky, a lot of boots, because I love boots. 
I, I was asking him, like, do you think it's too simple as far as this area or the town area? Oh, yeah. I said it's never too simple. Never go wrong with the issue. How long do you guys got left to do this? An hour and 12 minutes. Yeah, you know that you're in the time. Yeah, man. I've seen some more over, like, a little bit over in Michigan. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I wish I could wear them, but, you know, we'll see. You never know. <laughs> I can make it for you. Nice to meet you guys. Thank you, man. It's like work. Bro, what do you what do you think of my shoes? Try my best. Oh, thank you. Can I like them? Yes, sir. Appreciate you. Thank you. Appreciate the dope work. All right, guys. So if you guys didn't just see what happened, Pharrell came over and he actually got to like tell me how what he liked about my work, which was actually crazy, bro. Like I don't even know what to say. Off camera, he told me he's like, "Yo, that's dope. You got a lot of talent." And he, Obviously, he liked my shoes, but um, that was crazy. Yeah, uh, Adidas appreciate that for the experience. Let's look at Tony's shoe. Tony, what you got going on? Quickly. Got, so we got a suede toe box. I got this from the young one. You see the young one right here. Oh, it is. Yeah, and then I feel like this is kind of like an easy side pod for suede on both sides. And there's three stripes. We're gonna kind of figure it out, but I want to keep it like I want to kind of like do like a feather type of vibe to it. That. So we'll figure it out. Andrea. All right, Tony's doing work. This is just a, a preview of mine. I'll show you guys the full thing as soon as we are done. My midsole is done. My upper is done, which it looks kind of weird right now, but I literally just need to trim one more part. All right, guys, so my final product is done now, and this is my Adidas a sneaker. Now, obviously, it looks like it was made by a three-year-old. When it comes to sneakers, it's never done right on the first try, so obviously, it takes a few times. They send it back and forth to the factories. They get it all done, but this is just a general idea of what my shoe would look like. I love the colorway. I think just laces would complete it, but we didn't put laces on these because we didn't have enough time. All right, go ahead. Make your disclaimer first. Uh, it's trash, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> And I didn't finish it. Whoa! I know, I know. That was what it was supposed to look like. Why but some more stuff. It? What happened? Honestly, I got distracted. And I was filming. Content, baby. Content, Content, exactly. Be honest with me because you're the review guy. So you gotta give me the honest review. Well, I like the split in the middle. That's awesome. I dig this, man. The only thing I, we messed up on, we closed off the holes. So uh, we couldn't put laces. You can't lace it but up. laces would have made it look so. Sick. Laces would have been dope. Yeah. I wonder if you can just like punch holes through there and just yeah, like I'm weave them through yourself. <laughs> this is dope. Man. I love that sole too. Let me see yours, Tony. Hold on, it's not Hold done. Hold on, yet. okay, sensor. Okay, guys, we're waiting for Tony to show his sneaker. Wow, Tony, yours looks fire. Yours looks like a combination of like young ones and everything else. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, those are fire, legit. Adidas fam, hit us up. We want a sneaker. See, that's why I messed up is I can't put laces. I'm gonna cut holes in mine. I'm gonna punch holes. I wanna put laces in mine. Okay, go ahead and run it down. 22 Digital, man. We got the, the POD system in the back right here. You already know. Got a uh, basic uh, POD front. Young ones on the on the uppers, uh, neoprene, it's a suede toe box, EQT in the back, and we just we just living our life. Tony killed it, bro. This this is way better than mine. This is the best one I've seen. Like, look at that, young one on the front. Oh my god, this is good job, sir. It does look like an Adidas shoe. Like, if they actually put this into production, oh man. We, we had like we needed three hours. I see. I'm not so I'm not gonna knock anybody. I'm not gonna knock the other group, but I feel like group two was the creative group. Like we were like all creators. Like, oh my God, what a freaking experience! I just want to say that when I first started incorporating sneaker content into my YouTube channel, I knew I was gonna get opportunities, but I honestly never thought I would get opportunities this freaking big. At the time that it happened, I really was kind of speechless. That's why I was kind of like stuttering my words and not knowing what to say. Pharrell walked in there for a few minutes and he went to every table and at every table, I think there was like five tables, at every table he talked to one person. So he didn't sit there and talk to everybody. So that already was like, there was a chance I wasn't even gonna speak to him. But when he came to my table, I was able to talk to him and show him my design. And if you didn't catch what we, I kind of explained the project to him and he really thought, he basically said that it was like perfect as far as like, like he wouldn't change anything from what I was doing. So that was already a compliment. And, and then obviously I asked him like, what does he think of my shoes? And like, he was very grateful that I was rocking a product that he helped to design. So that was another thing that was dope because usually 
easily people would have been just like oh dope dope but he like was super super like humble and dope and excited that I had his shoe on and then third of all when he was walking away which I didn't even have on camera he looked at me and he's like yo man you've got a lot of talent I know you hear this a lot but you've got a lot of talent so just keep it up and I don't know if he thought I was like a sneaker designer or whatever which I'm, I'm not a sneaker designer hopefully one day I will be when a brand gives me an opportunity to create my own shoe or help collab on a shoe but Pharrell sees it in the boy, so I appreciate Adidas a thousand billion percent. Appreciate Adidas so much for bringing me all the way out here for this experience. I did not know that Pharrell was even gonna be there, so that was just like amazing. Even though we had a lot of content, even though I filmed a lot and got to go through a lot today, the night is still young. In about five minutes, I'm gonna meet the rest of the team in the lobby, and we are gonna go for a surprise surprise performance from